Welcome back to Elder Kings as Grand Master of House Dress. It's fantastic, really. Yeah, let's just uh, quickly take this back. Uh, N is the assault key. Huh, strange. Mm, I don't want to do what the enemy did <laughs> to me, so I'm going to go around. Okay, good. The leader of the... Uh, no, no, that's somebody else. Oh, well, whatever. Yeah, the leader of the uh, Tribunal Temple should be coming to my aid, hopefully. I don't want to... Oh, God. Oh, I'm missing a general on my center flank, and the general on my left flank is just bad. Alright, polite. No, that was a bad battle. It's actually quite bad. Um, Ransom prisoner? No, I'm kind of busy, and I kind of need more mercenaries. Oh, uh, can I just get a holy order? Well, no, because they're also my religion, so... Yeah. Alright, more mercenaries it is then. Merkwood, I guess. They look they look pretty cheap. I always just need cheap mercenaries right now, because I my economy can't really afford mercenaries. Alright, that shouldn't be too bad. I just gotta wait for the morale to recover is all. Oh, they're kind of gonna come over to me. I'm okay with that. Yeah, come on, damn it. I was hoping they'd come to my capital. Oh well. Are right, they going into the marsh? I'm gonna let them get movement locked, because I do want to fight them and just try to weaken them a little bit. Mostly so I can also try to just get some of my mercenaries killed. Because <laughs> if they're dead, I don't have to pay them. <laughs> Alright, they're going north. Uh, I kind of can't sanction uh, raids into other nations right now, but they worked, so that works for me. Yeah, let's just slave them. Alright, good, that was a stack wipe. And I'll actually be able to restructure the realm from this. Because, uh, yeah, either I own everything, or I own everything, actually. <laughs> this is a me versus everybody else scenario, apparently. Alright, so they just have the top holding here. Uh, range of marriage. Am I not married? Uh, no, I am. It's probably from, like, my son, or... I don't even know. Whatever. Yeah, at this point, I should be able to just win any battles that I want. Their army is weak and pathetic. Uh, hmm. Let's see. Can we colonize it or not? We'll be able to use clout and a large amount of money to petition the matriarch to let us colonize small territory. Alright, cool. So, basically, nothing changed. <laughs> there was no need to tell me anything. <laughs> Ooh, I gained groomed. Ooh, very nice. I am a beautiful man. <laughs> yeah, let's start assaulting everything. I have, uh... I don't have much money left, and these mercenaries are getting antsy about their pay. <laughs> oh, shit. Okay, that's not good. Yeah, I just assaulted a fort, and then that fort was... Ooh... Alright, hopefully that's not going to be an issue. Next, siege this. Uh, I don't have money to ransom prisoners right now. Um, hmm. Okay, well, I have the... War goal. Yeah. I think best thing to do right now is just rely on my own men. So I'm just going to disband the mercenaries. Uh, maybe try to, like, pull up my, uh, my levy again. Or maybe not, actually. This could be a problem. Okay. Running out of money. It's fun. Really fun. Um, okay, I can use clout to claim something, actually. I'm going to worry about that later. I'm kind of busy right now in a civil war. Yeah, ideally I need my ticking war score to go up faster. Because, yeah, I can't really do much. They've got, like, just so many men to defend, and I just have, like, no men <laughs> to go on the offensive with. Yeah, they're going to come try to take Mar. Mar is really easy to siege, and that actually might break my ticking war score. If it does, that's bad. I'm getting a lot of slaver events. Unfortunately, they're not doing very good for me. I think I could borrow... Yeah, I can borrow some money. I kind of need it, unfortunately. Alright, let's get more mercenaries. Uh, sure, let's get the Blackwater Bandits. 
Actually, I can get a larger mercenary band for a similar monthly cost. And the same uh, thing. Hmm. Yeah, let's get these guys. The pass keepers. Yeah, let's just fight with mercenaries. I got the money for it-ish. Even though I am running on loans, it's not ideal, but I'll take it. Alright, take that. Yeah, I've lost my Ticking War score now, which is quite bad. I need to get that back as soon as possible. Alright, now let's kill them. Kill them. I got my Ticking War score back. Uh, someone is imprisoned, apparently. You're not going away this time, my friend. You only die. Ah, the Tribunal Temple is finally here. It took you guys long enough. I almost won the damn war by myself. Been waiting for you guys to get here. Lazy bastards. Good. I suppose now it's time for a bit of a restructuring in house dress, yes? <laughs> Alright, money. Uh, can't change my focus just yet. Alright, so do we have title revoking allowed? Uh, no. And, yeah, I don't have a council, so they're just going to say no no matter what. Mm. Alright, well, let's uh, try to get as many loyalists as possible, then. I got one loyalist. <laughs> Damn it. Uh, who would prefer it? I think pragmatists prefer revoking title over glory hounds, I think. And I also have an advisor now. The advisor is uh, useless. Alright, can I get revoked title, please? Uh, there's one opponent, for some reason. Why is there an opponent? Because hmm. your opinion is less than 59. Alright, well, I'll just replace you then. Why are you? You're the marshal. Alright, get out of here. Stupid bitch. Let's replace you with a pragmatic who is going to be like, I don't know if I want it or not. Actually, let's get this guy. See how a... Yeah, see how my kinsman feels about it. Really, you're also an opponent. Hmm. At least the pragmatists are like, I don't know what I want. It's a weird thing. Alright, let's get this guy. Come on. That works for me, because... Yeah. <laughs> now I can restructure the realm and make House Dress not a shithole anymore, yeah? Traitor... Mm, I'll figure out what to do with you. You are not a traitor, apparently. I guess you were just a vassal of the real traitor. Hmm. I could just take the tyranny. Hmm, no, that's a dangerous idea. Well, I need to give out this land to somebody, so let's figure that out. Oops, wrong button. Let's right, so search my realm for... I guess it doesn't matter what the gender is. Yeah, there's... Yeah, the Elder Kings doesn't really care about gender for anything. Uh, imprisoned? No. Married? It doesn't matter. Ruler? No. Diplorange? Well, they're in my realm, so... Uh, join court? Doesn't really matter. Um, my religion and my culture. Yes. Although, if they're in my court, they probably are my religion and my culture. Yeah, whatever, it's fine. Alright, so let's grant you, uh, Podomai. Let us grant you, Severa. Yeah, no. What do you mean he must be able to produce heirs? Oh, he's a monk. Okay. You will get Severa then. Uh, Mar, I believe, should be given out. I could keep it for myself, but, eh. You can get Mar. There we go. Restructure the realm a little bit. I'm going to let this man die in jail for being a filthy traitor. Same with him. So, yes, let's try to use some of my clout then. Try to get some land from the other great houses. How does that work then? So, I can use clout to claim Tell Ansi. Where is... Tel well, okay, so it's got Tel in it, which tells me that it's probably one of the Telvani. 
um, who are up here. Talancy. I don't know. Oh, is that? Or no, that's because I have it selected. Um, oh, there we go. Yeah, use claim to uh, use claim to claim this. Yes. Also, for my five hit, opinion, hit with all the other gray houses, their vassals in the temple for five years. That's fine. Ah, damn it. Using his own clout, Grandmaster Norris of Grey House Indoril refuted our claim, stating that Aldsotha is firmly under his house and that it will never change. Damn it. Yeah, that's uh, yeah, that's part of a duchy that I primarily hold. Maybe if I held the duchy, then I would have had more uh, claim to it, but oh well. Do I have too many duchy titles? I do. That's going to piss people off a little bit. Yeah, let's give this to this guy, sure. Yeah, you can be the... Really? What do you mean it's part of your de jure territory? You fucking idiot. What? Oh, no, I'm looking at the completely wrong thing. Yeah, you're on land that you should get a title. It's a duchy title. You wouldn't even get land from this, you idiot. Ugh. Ah, yes, the classic uh, CK2. You can't give out land... All because your council is a bunch of dickheads. Seriously. Oh, okay, yeah, you're the part of the yeah, you're part of the trader group, so I don't really care about you all that much. Although they are quite strong, which is rather annoying. Yeah, I really need to kill these guys somehow because they're causing problems. Lots of problems. Oh well, I'll gladly uh kick their ass in a war and throw them in jail. Simple as that. Yeah, I, I need my army to recover. So slow. So fast in CK3, but here it's so damn slow. I have a new heir. Who is that heir? Why is it my uncle? Uh, okay. It's a very strange choice for to be my uncle and not my, like, say, son. Oh, wait, but I haven't actually set a choice for who I want my vote to be, right? I believe so, yes. So... Ooh, my son is a mage. I think I'd like my heir to be a mage, actually, yes. Hmm. He doesn't feel like a dress. He's not a member of the house council. Oh, well, let's fix that then. Um. Oh, he's landed off in the Inderils. What the hell? How did you get land in the Inderils? <laughs> it's very strange. Um, hmm. That's going to cause some problems, actually. I kind of need to get my son back. Huh. How annoying. Ransom a prisoner. My brother. He's actually not bad. Nah, you can keep him. I need money to hire mercenaries because of my damn traitorous vassals. Oh yeah, no, he can stay in there raw. Actually, you know what? Throw him in the ubulet. I don't want to think about him. Excel an artifact? What artifact is that? Oh yeah, the yeah, random crap that I've found along the way. Uh, Alright, so colonizing Vardenfell. Yeah, how does that work? Can I just, like, colonize Vivek? <laughs> I need 500 gold to colonize? Well, I want to colonize Vivek, so... <laughs> I'm going to colonize Vivek. <laughs> I I'm probably going to be denied. I assume it's also based off whether or not the Arch Cannon allows you to do it. But... Um, it'll be interesting if I could just call this Vivek. So, yeah. Let's go on a pilgrimage, actually. It's extra favor and all that. Although, I do have a dangerous faction, so that might cause me some issue, but I'm sure it's fine. Hey, diplomacy. That might help me. Oh, yeah, I gotta tell my uh, council to do stuff. Oh, that would probably help a lot, yeah. Alright, good. Back home from the pilgrimage. Very nice. Hopefully make my vassals like me a little bit more. Although, yeah, that whole, uh, desire, uh, no, no, desire is duchy. Wait, do they not care about the fact that I'm holding three duchy titles? Uh, it appears to be the case, yes. Huh. Okay. So I must just have short reign and the fact that, oh, they're blackmailing me again. Really, you like me and you're blackmailing me? What an asshole. Hm. Well, I won't be blackmailed, you traitors. Really, I gave you land. Filthy traitor. 
Right, let's call the temple in to help me again. Okay, you guys might just end up dying. Okay, no. These guys might just end up dying, though. So let's just get rid of them. I think I'm probably going to have to hire mercenaries again. Unfortunately. Alright, you guys just go ahead and get this bandits. Come on. Move faster, you fucking bastards. What the hell? Oh, was I attacked? Enderal uh, War for a claim on Severa. Okay, you're being an asshole. Yeah, they've got 3,000 men. Oh boy, I can't really deal with that. You know, dress is rather weak, annoyingly. <laughs> I blame the uh, shit leaders that we had at the beginning. Alright, well now I've got a civil war and a actual war to contend with. Fantastic. Hmm. Yeah, let's give this title to... You, I guess. Yeah, I'm just stacking up a Council of Loyalists. This is good. And then I could remove the grant title ability from my council, and I'll be happy. You know, the tribunal is going to be coming over here slowly to help me out with the war against Enderil. Oh, wait, they're already here, pretty much. Shit. Okay. Oh, yeah, this is good to know that apparently the, uh... Yeah, apparently the Grey Houses can call the Tribunal against aggressive Grey Houses. So yeah, Diplomacy might be the best option, to be honest. Hmm. Yeah, I'll go kick their ass myself then. See so yeah, the Tribunal apparently failed. Useless bastards. <laughs> yeah, the AI loves building forts in this mod for some reason. I think that's actually just because, um... Uh, forts can actually be upgraded in this mod, so... I'm pretty sure, at least. Uh, is there a fort over here that I can look at? No. Is there a fort, like, anywhere? Yeah, there's a fort here. Yeah, you can upgrade forts a little bit. Just to make them a little bit more annoying. I'm a worse dueler? Yeah, sure, let's fight. Ah, shit. I shouldn't have done that. <laughs> yeah, no, to take, take somebody else instead, I actually can't afford to, uh, get captured. <laughs> I should probably not be leading battles, that shit I am. Yeah, the Tribunal Temple is extremely powerful. So yeah, I do have to be a little careful about fighting the other houses. Uh, let's see, we surrender? Good. Are right, you? Get out of here. And you, also get out of here. The traitors are not rewarded in my realm. And I find new people to take command of these areas. Alright, it's Patamai. And you... Actually, you have two different diseases. I'm not going to choose you. You're a monk. You're also a monk. Alright, you're not a monk good. So you could take Sothasil. Excellent. Now that just leaves this guy, although he's quite loyal. He might not cause me any problems. Yeah, he's quite loyal. Let's, uh... Let's just weaken his power, then. Just fabricate a claim on his territory. Yeah, then I think everybody else only owns a single province, except for me, who owns multiple provinces. Very nice. Oh, I'm going to lose Greyhouse Dress. Hmm. I'll need to be careful, then. Perhaps even going to... Vec, was it? Hmm. No, it was, um, so the sill. Yes. Yeah, that gives me extra health and personal combat skill, actually, so that's very useful. And, yeah, now I'm Alexia, I can't really do much. Yeah, it's quite dangerous, though, that the temple will come in to defend any Grey House, even if it's from another Grey House. Um, mm -hmm. Yeah, I don't want to lose my Amulet of Unity, but they are better at combat than me. Oh, no. Shit. Okay, can I, like... Yeah, my uncle. Um, if, if my uncle gets elected, then it's not too bad. Aldrin Dress? Yes. Oh, it's not enough. Shit. 
Oh, and this isn't multiplayer, so I can't just leave the event going. Oh, no. Um, I... Uh, I could default on the loan, but I don't think that allows me to take out a new loan. Um, oh, shit. Uh, extort subjects? I get 30 gold. That's not enough. I need... How much gold do I need to make the Duchy of Tyr? Or the King of Tyr, even? 540 gold. Shit. I don't think there's anything I can do. I was being a bit too... I shouldn't have been leading armies. Oh, that was a dumb mistake. That was a really, really dumb mistake, and now I'm no longer the Grandmaster. And I actually might even lose my capital. Actually, will I lose my capital? Not if... Not if I think... The new leader has already landed, which he... Oh, it's this asshole. Oh, god damn it! this is the guy I was trying to fucking take power away from. Ugh, great. Fantastic. Who's my heir, then? My son, who is this guy? Wait, so am I going to be in the Inderals, then? Is he going to... I have no idea. Okay, um, what's happening now? Uh, okay, stop swaying someone. Okay. Uh, okay, things aren't too bad. I lost the Grand Master title, but I can get it back. Alright, let's join up the Council of Dress, vote for myself to be uh, the next leader. Let's move my capital over to Tyr, away from this nonsense. Uh, points Counselor, I become the Marshal, that's pretty good. Uh, I mean, I'm not a great Marshal, but I'll take it. Wait a minute. Did I keep all my vassals? Alright, so I kept all the vassals, except for, I think, one. That's kind of funny. Alright, so I'm still, like, extremely powerful, just not the Grand Master. Oh, that's fine. Do I have my father's debts, or... Yeah, my father's debt. No, it looks like... Oh, no, I... Ugh. Should I just default on the loan? Uh, it's kind of costly to default on loans. I don't really want to pay it, though. You know, let's just pretend the loans don't exist. It's fine. <laughs> Build an observatory. No, we're not going to be doing that. We're going to be going business to make some money. I might actually be able to start raiding now for just getting, like, a proper amount of slaves, to be honest. Yeah, let's see. Yeah, in Argonia, they only have about, like, 750-ish men there. Ooh, they've got, like, 1,400 there. About 900 to 1,000 there. Hmm. Oh, God, yeah. Things are bad. I gotta, like, set a bunch of crap. Do I have a child? No, I don't. And my wife has... Uh, cancer. So she's probably not gonna give me a child. Yeah, I guess I'll give out uh, this land over here. Since, yeah, I'm above my domain limit right now. It's kind of annoying, to be honest. Oh, this... Wait, why is this place still depopulated? What? Uh... Does it take that long to fucking repopulate the province or some shit? And what about my other two provinces? Um, hmm. Well, at least I have a reason as to why this province is shit now. Um, yeah, I can't even, like, throw more money into it to make it, like, not shit. Oh, boy, all I can do is just wait until the province is no longer depopulated, which is taking way longer than I was expecting to. A red guard man who's also a eunuch. Yeah, sure, I'll take him. I don't know what I'm going to do with him, though. Actually, if he's a loyalist, I can just toss him into the council. I can't even make him into a spy master, which so I wanted to make him. Where's my eunuch? <laughs> I feel lied to. Although I do see another loyalist, although they're kind of shit. Uh, a dangerous faction, huh? Hmm. I suppose you just want to be on the council? Well, the problem is your best stat is already taken up by somebody who is much more useful than you. Here, here, here's the plan. Let's make you into the Spy Master, because you're actually still pretty good at that. There we go. Why am I antagonizing someone? Stop it. 
wonder this asshole hates me. Hey, hey. Uh, yeah, he's just a baron and I toss him under somebody so he won't cause me any issues. Now, I want to set my steward to be the asshole vassal who's causing me problems. This guy. Yes. And I also want to murder my wife, but I can't do that because nobody wants to help me. Unless if I pay them. Ugh. Fine, here, you take some money and join me in helping murder her. Hey, money. <laughs> there we go, we have over 100%, so she should die eventually. And I'm no longer wounded as well, fantastic. My uncle is the current heir to house dress. How annoying. Uh, yeah, what is... Wait, am I not the candidate currently? Why am I not voting for myself? I should have been. I'll set it up at some point. Um, hmm. they're not in there for some reason. What the hell? My brother, my kinsman, my kinsman. I have no clue. Very strange. <laughs> Just not on the list anymore. Ah, oh, damn it, my plot got revealed. How annoying. Oh, well, I'll just try again. It's fine. Oh, finally. Now my capital won't be completely useless, although it still has new administration. Are you kidding me? Alright, it's only got a new administration for one year. Oh, boy. Yeah, once that's gone, though, then things are going to be good. And I can actually sort of keep things under control. I've got a bunch of prisoners. I could banish you for some gold. Banish you for gold. Yeah, you're a traitor. And I don't want to release you, so yeah, you're staying in there. Although 70 gold is tempting. Yeah, same with you, you're also a traitor, so... Really? Ugh. Useless. Useless, useless, useless. Oh, I have a claim on the house, apparently. Hold on, I mean, I actually might be able to start a faction for myself then. Uh, and also depending on if my liege is weak enough or not. Yeah, I'm resigning from the council. Uh, where is the resign from the council? There it is. Yeah, I'm resigning from the council and starting up a plot to make myself the leader. Yes. Now I don't want to be your commander. Fuck off. Yeah, so hopefully people will join me. Although then again, he only has like one vassal who can really join him. Ah, my liege has gone to war for slaves. That'll make him quite weak. <laughs> very good. Very, very good. And I'm just building my riches so I can... Just hire any mercenaries that I might require. Where did all those men come from? What the hell? How do you have 6,000 men? What the fuck? Oh, the tribunal temple's here. Wait, isn't this an offensive war? It is. What the hell? Huh. That's quite annoying because I need him to get weaker, not stronger. Uh, yes. So just say damn and then hire Vivek to fucking deal with it. <laughs> there we go. Yeah, with help from the tribunal, actually, that's really causing some problems for me. And I'm a known murderer now. Oh, fuck. A uh, useless, useless wife who refused to give me an heir. Ugh. Whatever. Okay, no genius. Are there any quicks? There is, but they're human. Humans and elves mate. I suppose so, because that's how Bretons came to exist. Um. Uh, can I get a strong? There's even a strong elf. Yes, I'd prefer to take an elf, just because they'll be less of a pain in the ass for me. Yeah, I have to wait a few years, though, for them to come of age, unfortunately. Okay. Their capital is currently just sieged out. I think it's time that I uh, demand... Well, for one, maybe ask Vivek for some help. No, that's a completely different thing. Um, ooh, perfect. Perfect, yes. Good. Good. Wait, oh, they hired mercenaries. God damn it. Or event spawned, even better. I found a new appreciation for that asshole. He stole my title from me. My rightfully deserved title. What an asshole, man. 
I mean, look, they're getting their ass beat by Argonians. Like, how fucking pathetic do you have to be? And now Argonians are trying to conquest South Asil. It is pathetic. Yeah, they're having to get their ass bailed out by the tribunal. <laughs> what the hell? Seriously? Where are you getting all these men from? What the hell? 5,000 event spawns? Excuse me? What the shits? This event spawn troops better fuck off and cease to exist after this war. Because that is bullshit. Fucking 6,000 event spawn troops. Yeah, get out of here with that bullshit. Alright, I'll be taking my throne back, thank you very much. Excellent. Yes, I will honor the temple and their traditions. What? <laughs> yeah, and I'll serve the council personally. That was very strange. Excellent. Back in control, as it should be. Now it's time to deal with that traitor, yeah? Yeah, let's take his capital from him. That way I can just throw him under a uh, random vassal. Let's see here. Yes, things are not looking too bad. Eh, let's just go do some slave raiding. Why not? Yeah, get some filthy Argonians to work the mines and such for me. A warlord. Hmm. I could become a warlord. <laughs> that is not what I had in mind, though. I could, though, invade Argonia. Hmm. I don't hate that idea. While I don't think I can win a war against the other great houses, I could win a war against Argonians. And once I become a warlord, I have unlimited use of the warlord cast spell, I believe. Yes, I think I will. <laughs> New plan, boys. We're not going raiding, we're going invading. Yeah, so let's start with this small and weak. Really? Why is there an orc on my council? There. Now, we're going to Argonia. Any objections? I thought not. Just throw a loyalist on the council as well, why the hell not? Alright, where is the warlord cast spell I? I might have to wait a month for it to actually show up. For the game to, like, recognize that I should have it. Oh, I don't have it. Hmm. I think I remember having this problem last time I played Elder Kings. Uh, where the Warlord cast spell I just didn't exist for some reason. <laughs> Let's see. I need to win a war using the Warlord cast spell I. But I do not have a Warlord cast spell I. That could be for one of a few reasons I'm thinking of is... Uh, one, it's potentially just because I'm a subject. That might be why. Um, it could also be because well, I don't really know what, what another reason would be to be honest. That's well, just slave raid fight. Yes, they have Black Marsh who's going to come and help them. Black Marsh is kind of useless though. Slave raid it is. Mm, yeah, I don't have a reason to call the tribunal into my war. I'm not a coward. <laughs> you hopefully get that damn orc killed or a pain in the ass. It just caused me problems, to be honest. Damn it. That can't cleanse my provinces of refugees? That's just rude. Black Marsh actually came to their aid. How annoying. Yeah, they're not going to get through tier in time, though. Because, yeah, my uh, old liege built a fort there. <laughs> Dumbass Argonians. Oh, that's expensive. Sure, I'll keep it running. Yeah, a bit of a bad battle, but I should be fine, yeah. The Argonians are weak, and I have great generals. Yeah, so does this uh, cast spell I work. Any province bordering uh, 
his realm will be enslaved. Wait. Any province bordering Chieftain Redius's the Just's realm will be enslaved. I think that's backwards because it's saying that any province bordering his realm, meaning my land, will be enslaved. What? This includes any province one sea tile away from a realm or two if you are part of a seafarer religion or culture, or have a slave or bloodline. If there are more provinces to enslave than you have available, the slaves will be sold. Any province to slave that way will increase your renown as a slaver. Well, I think how it's supposed to work, um, even though the text is kind of wrong and backwards, is all enslaved Stormholds, uh, Coromont, and Riverbridge. Even though the text is backwards saying I'll enslave my own provinces, but whatever. <laughs> yeah, we don't have enough men now to really do anything. It's fantastic. And perhaps I could finally start a reign that is good and not horrible and awful. <laughs> mm. They, uh, I guess they just like got some of their men back. Or no, they hired like a really weak mercenary band, huh? Okay. Yeah, they're dead, or, well, not dead, but they're, like, beaten a little bit. Oh, I got the, uh, that shit. Okay. Uh, do I have a physician? No, I do not, but now I do, bare minimum. Yeah, spell of cure disease. Oh, no. That's not good. Um, alright, uh, potion, potion, potion. I need a... I need a cure, or not cure disease, I need a, like, fortify health potion, yeah. Plus three health for 400 gold. Oh, fuck. Yeah, I kind of have to. I have, what is my health then? Minus three from horrible mistreatment. Minus five from that. All right, let's take a hunting focus for that one health that'll give me. Let's buy a potion of fortify health. I don't really have a choice. I kind of need to have that potion. All right, that bare minimum, like, cancels out the horrible mistreatment. Uh... This guy likes me, so the fact that he, like, horribly mistreated on me is kind of surprising. So I guess it was just, like, an unlucky roll. Uh, okay, good. I got a dog. Yes, I will accept this gift. That should give me some more health, hopefully. Uh, no, it doesn't. Oh, god, no. Um, okay. It's fine. Oh, the, uh, this Velothi Charger gives me more health than the horse does. Uh, oh, god, I I'm really just grasping at straws here. Shit. Yeah, how long does the potion of fortify health work for? Five years? Alright, not great, but it'll do. Actually, wait, I think I just ask Vivek to heal me. Yeah. As much as I don't want Vivek touching me. <laughs> oh boy. While well, I hold court, Vivek approaches me. I see that you are indeed ill. Suave. There is no need for you to suffer, or to perish here. Treat your enemies well, and your friends even better, and count yourself among the latter. Vivek touches both of his hands to one of my shoulders. Just for a moment, some magic goes courses through me, and I feel my ailment disperse. He lowers his arms and smiles. We exchange farewells, and the poet takes his leave. Excellent. I completely forgot that I could just do that. That I wish I would have done that from the start. Oh, <laughs> because uh, I just spent fucking what was it, four or five hundred gold on a potion I didn't need. Ugh. Yeah, I need you to be better, because you almost got me goddamn killed. <laughs> oh, my horse is dead, anyways. Oh well. Yeah, I might just try to become a slaver. Get a slaver bloodline, that will help out a little bit. And I'll just get a bunch of Argonian slaves, I like that idea. <laughs> oh, I need- I have a crown focus, right, I forgot about that. That's a thing in this game. Ah, right, good. So yeah, so I enslave all the neighboring provinces. And I have a bunch of slaves now? Maybe I just automatically sold them. Not sure. Although my place being sieged out, that's rather annoying. Damn Argonians! Get out of Morrowind, you damn lizard bastards! Filthy Argonians. Well, I think that's a good stopping off point. If you enjoyed, leave a like, subscribe, Discord in the description below. And yeah, I'll see you next time.